enjoy watching and I'm going to be asking you questions and I hope we can get through all this um, and have fun. Yay. Okay, so here begins the show. Come on. Thank you, camera. All right. Now, um... All right, this Zoom is wild. Hope you didn't get a headache there. First piece. This is a shell. This is 22 gauge silver. This is about one foot eight inches. Uh, I don't even know what that is. Probably half a meter. And bring it to the middle. Bending, crimp, crimp, loop. Let's make that loop rounder. Okay. Lock the loop in. Sometimes you want to loop bigger than your round nose pliers, so don't always depend on them. Sometimes if you really want to be a stickler, you can get like a pen or a skinny pencil or something in there, but sometimes you can just bend it with your fingers and it comes out even enough. And so I'm gonna start out with this simple tried and true pattern where we make a swirl at the bottom after crossing the two ends. Works for any piece, any stone that you wanna make into a necklace or even earrings, but it has to be drilled straight through to do this pattern. And then we come across like this. And uh, yeah, we come across like this. Fold these, twist them twice and back. That just locks them in. Come back around up like this, bend them like that. Sorry for bumping the camera and then position them where you want them. That looks good. And just start to wrap them around the top in a scarf. Um, this is a really pretty shell piece. I don't know what kind of shell. I think it might have a little bluish dye added. Look at the iridescence on that though, really. Oh, this. So YouTube uses a different technology for this camera than what what my uh, camera usually uses. It's weird, but the focus and the zoom and everything is different, but it seems to be working out okay. So cut it off, tuck in the two tabs, the two sharp ends so they never come out and scratch anybody. And that is... Simple. Let's see how much I'm running out of these jump rings. I never got them organized, so I have all these sizes. Big mess. If you're one of those tedious people, or not tedious, but one of those people who just enjoys organizing jump rings, like it's therapeutic for you. There are some people like that. Um, come on down and I'll hire you. Because I can't stand messing around with these jump rings. Oh, I shouldn't even put them back because I'm probably going to use them in the next piece. Or use them in the next part. But anyway, jump ring. Open. Close. You should close your jump rings very carefully. But I've been doing this for years. And when you put three on, it makes it extra strong. Um, so I can kind of feel that they're closed enough. Um, put a microscope on them and maybe they could be adjusted a little more if I went slower, but they will do the job. Do I have enough of a necklace left? This is a 16 inch. I don't even think it's 16 inch. I, um, I think it might be 16 inch. I might be too small. This would be like for a choker or for someone with a skinny neck. Um, this is, oh, this one's better. This one's 18 and that one, I like that better anyway. All right. So I'm running low on necklaces, but I have a few here. So this one's getting this necklace and um, unless I can always use a black cord because I have a bazillion of them at the moment. Oh, if you think I should rather have the black cord, if you like that better, it looks kind of cool with the blue. Let's vote now, chain or cord? Hey, Karen, we only have four people here. Um, and nobody has commented or the comments are delayed. I don't know which it is. Maria says cord. Lock in your voting now. 
Meanwhile, while you're... Oh, three for cord. Okay, cord it is. Save the chain. Well, we're going to use this chain somewhere else, I bet. All right, yeah, I think that really does look good with the cord. I always ask people, are you right-handed or left-handed if they're in person? Because um, usually I could slide it on, but this little jump ring at the end catches on this particular cord, so I have to take that off first. 90% roughly of people are right-handed, so I make it, if your pendant has a front and a back, I always put the clasp in what would be their right hand if they were to hold it up to their neck and put it directly on. Now, um, if they say left-handed, obviously I put the clasp in the other hand. If, if I don't have the customer in front of me, then I just assume it's right-handed because it's a nine to, nine to ten, nine to one guess that I'm right. Um, so this is pretty, I think it's also, it might, it's either shell or jasper or halite, but those are kind of pretty and they look like they kind of go. And these are kind of pretty and they look like they kind of go, that might be the same stone, just smaller. But let's, that's the same exact stone is boring. So let's try a little baby amethyst, little, little four millimeter amethyst. So pretty. Uh, whoops. Come on, amethyst. And let's see. I like that for earrings. Um, or we could reverse it. I happen to have some beads here to play with. You could do the amethyst as the as the bigger six millimeter. And well, hold still. And this little bead as the smaller one. Mm, I kind of like this. I'm just going to go with this. Okay. So these are going to be the earrings. Um, let's get 20 gauge silver and just need about three and a half inches. Probably not, probably too much. This is going to be easy. Yeah. Now these these little guys trying to find the hole is like made for people more dexterous, dexterous, Dexter, Dexter the lovable sitcom. It's fun for the whole family. Um, and you could just end the little loop right here. If you want to be real simple, just cut it, boom, 20 gauge is strong enough, it'll hold it. But why not give it a little zest? Remember that soap? Zestfully clean. Zestfully clean. All these people would, like throw their towel up in the air in the in the camera to be all like, ha ha ha, I just threw my towel up. But the camera's on the other side, so catches your eye. Definitely a good marketing scheme. You're all these attractive people just throwing their towel up in the camera. You're not fully clean unless you're zest. I, I shouldn't do the whole jingle. I might get a copyright infringement. All right. Let's see. There's one. When you're at a state fair doing this for 12 hours a day and you just got to sell them as fast as people can buy them, um, you get a little fast. I'm actually not even going as fast as I could because I'm trying to talk to you guys too and read comments and make sure I don't go off camera like this because then it's like people are like, what are you doing? And I'm like, I'm making this beautiful piece right here. Can you see how beautiful it is? Oh, it's so, and then I swirl it. And this is the technique that nobody knows. Watch this when I swirl it. And everybody's like, where, where are you? I'm over here. Anyway. Um, so see, I, I made that loop. I made that bend too high up so now that stone can't get in there so what do we do we just wiggle it just wiggle it and oh now look what i did what is that what did i do I'm just making messes here well let's cut that off there's nothing wrong with that just go oh, i'm having a whole trouble holding that still all right let's cut off try that again So 
Here I am talking about how fast I can go when I'm not paying attention. All right, there. Now, again, bend. And roll that, wrap it, wrap it, wrap it, wrap it, wrap it around a couple times, make it pretty. Cut it, tuck it. Good. They need something else. Let's add something to them. Um, where's our 18 gauge? This will be a piece that has 20, 18, and um, this is 18 square. Let's try this. I've never done this before. I made a little sculpture with the 18 square. Um, these are two pieces about three inches long. Let's get them the same. And we'll just do something simple. Let's make a little, little swirl. Sometimes with the square wire, you can bend it right, right with your fingers. It's like, oh, la la, it's so easy to bend. You know, it's funny. Um, people say that, you know, when you're under pressure, you can't think right, can't be creative, you need to relax and just let yourself breathe. And there is uh, definitely something to be said for that. You need your rest. You need to recharge. Don't burn yourself out. Don't run and run and run and run until you're not enjoying it anymore and think you're just going to beat everything by outrunning everybody and just exhausting yourself. But on the other hand, sometimes when you have too much space, you get lazy and then you get bored and then you start overthinking and then you don't do anything and then you give up. Whereas if you're under pressure, sometimes pressure forces you to be focused and that actually forces you to be even more creative because there's no time to worry and there's no time to overthink and so you just do and the more you do and the more you do you start finding yourself moving down this path that's a really interesting path and um, I don't worry I didn't have getting a little fight with the grizzly bear not this time that's just paint but you start moving down this path and you you start finding your creative juices freed your creative muscles, however you, however you want to look at it. And um, so sometimes being under pressure makes you more creative. And I, I often found that th to be the case when I was at state fairs and time was of the essence and it costs a ton of money to rent the, play, the booth, a ton of money to pay for the hotel. And if we didn't make that money back every day and then some, it was a huge waste and a huge painful, hard working waste. So there is this extra emphasis to just um, produce fast and sell fast. Not just produce, but like talk people into looking at the stuff, trying to take time to find the piece that they like the best, all that. Uh, why does that look like that's not going? to looks like it's going to be a little too long let's see it could be wrong no no it might be fine it'd be just fine let's see yeah that loop is a little bit bigger but it's close it's really close can you see it Yeah, so we'll just cut a tiny bit off. Tuck it a little tighter. Roll it a little more. And these are cute little guys with this square wire, aren't they? Not bad, right? Now I could turn them. Let's see, I could just, I could just have them hang they would spin every which way. Um, but I'm going to take a teeny tiny little uh, jump ring and connect them that way. They'll give them a little more dangle and you know, 
that way I can make them when they actually come to rest they'll every part will be facing forward with the prettiest part facing out the way I like it um so these were really fun I had no intention of doing this I would have popped I would have just popped a charm on to the bottom of each of these beads, just a little silver charm. That would be the fast way to do, but I don't have any charms with me and I don't want to leave you guys. So I was forced to make this little swirly swirl thing and I like it. I really like how it came out. I think it's fun. I think I'm going to make more of them. I'll do a whole video on them. You guys saw it here first. Whoops. Let's get a little. Get a little bit, get a little bit of your earring hooks out. Why am I putting that down? I'm going to need that again. Get a little bit, get a little bit of your earring hooks on the piece. Ba-dum, ba-dum, ba-dum. Ba -da 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 now, you always want the prettiest part to piece out when the earring hook is going in to the ear, so just think about that. Especially if you make earring hooks that don't spin too much. If they spin like crazy, then it doesn't matter as much. There's like, like no in between. It either zooms way up or far, far, far. Like, there we go, we kind of got an in between there. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. See the man with the lonely eyes Just take his hand, he'll be surprised Can you imagine? You're like in a bar and You're like trying to give a little bit give a, give a little bit of your love to someone And you see some guy sitting at the end of the bar And he has lonely eyes And so you just walk up to him and you're like Mr. Lonely Man, I'm here for you And then you just Put your hand in his hand and you walk him away from his lonely corner and you take him over to your friends. Wouldn't that like be really, really nice in a movie and end really, really badly in real life? Hello. Well, I'll say hello to everybody because I haven't said hello. I just, um, all I did was ask the first few people if I should use cord, and cord is what they picked. Nobody said chain. But it's good to see all of you. Thanks for coming. This is number 21. If you would like to purchase number 21 and it hasn't been purchased yet, you may do so now. It, you'll just see this when you go to Etsy. But you can do it if you want, and it'll be there for you. Da, 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 da. Ma da 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 You always want to make them look good for the photo, but you know as soon as you put the lid on, they're getting bounced everywhere, especially once the male people get a hold of them. Oh well. That's 21 people. Okay. Um 22. What do we do? What do we do for 22? Ah, let's get a cool amethyst. Pretty amethyst. Um, Let's do 22 again. We're going to run out of this 22. I should get more. 22. Let's again take a little less than two feet, about half a meter. But through to the middle, do our famous pattern again, but let's do something a little different. How different? I don't even know. I'm just going to try to think of something. Uh, uh, that's not the pretty side. That's the pretty side. Look at that. Look at that. Okay. Pretty. All right. So, see the man with the lonely eyes. Take his hand, he'll ask you, why the hell are you touching his hand when you're a total stranger in the bar? Let's give a little bit, 
Give a little bit of your information to the cops once he calls them because you just walked up to him and grabbed his hand and then acted really weird and he got weirded out and he decided to um, ask the the bartender to take care of you and you start acting weirder so the bartender called the authorities and give a little bit give a little bit of your kindness to the police officer who's now taking your statement and let's see what we do here watch this super fun super super fun right now you saw where i just went across like this and then came back around that side and went up and that's always pretty but let's just put these strands together come together silver strands over me and let's go whoosh whoosh a whoosh a whoosh a whoosh just, just bend them you gotta push them in really tight because they try to try to get away from you they don't want to be made tight they want to be loose loosey loose as a caboose and you gotta fight them you gotta press your nail really tight to get that loop really bad but if you do it if you really muscle it in it's not hard muscling it in it just takes some pressure but then you get a whole lot of little swirlies on one little piece like this and they all fit they all fit so cute you can even loop them around and do wilder stuff if you want to but i'm just going to keep this simple just to show you because sometimes simple is so pretty simple is sometimes the best sometimes um and now we're going to scarf it again and look see how it slides over there just slide it back just kind of position it how you want it to be and then come around again and then tuck it tuck the sharp ends in pop Na -na 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 -na. give a little bit of your bail money to your friend because he tried to talk to the guy at the end of the bar who had the lonely eyes okay um now i will ask you again shall we do chain well let's put the jump rings on first see if i can find three more of these rip you can you don't need three you can do one you can do two I usually do three. I just like it. I like three. It makes me happy. Uh, that one's a little different. Every once in a while, you've got two different metals. They're like the same same metal technically. They're both silver, but they're like made two different places, and it looks weird. But at least if you're like me, and you're just constantly collecting jump rings from everywhere under the sun, because the place you used to get them from that was really good, um, you can't find them anymore, and then the new place doesn't make them right, and so you just keep trying different places all right here we go boom Chain. Or. Oh, I have this all the way over here. Cord. Definitely chain. Okay. Cord. La I agree. I, I agreed both times. I really liked the cord last time. But I, I could have gone either way last time. This time I was hoping it would be chain. All right, chain it is. And here's another question. Leave the chain like this so you can slide it off so people can put their own chain if they want to trade it or whatever, or if the chain starts to get icky after a year. Or put a fatter jump ring on the end so it's easier to clasp. And so if they drop it and they catch the chain and it slides all the way down to the end, the stone won't fall off. And then just trust that they'll be able to remove that jump ring if they want to change the chain. Big jump ring, big jump ring on the end or no big jump ring? You tell me. Um, I was wrestling a grizzly bear and I pretty much put him down, but 
he got one little nibble on my finger. Okay, prefer to be able to move it. Then if nobody else says anything, we'll go with that. Oh, we now we have one for big jump ring. It's a tie. We need a tiebreaker. What's it gonna be? Okay, big jump ring wins. I, I had a I hired someone once and she just lectured me for like half an hour about why she couldn't change the chains for the customers and I should never make them so that you can't just slide them right off. So ever since then I've been really really sad, but most of you are jewelry makers, so I understand why you'd be like, that's no big deal taking a jump ring off, my goodness. And I'd rather not think I clasped it and I didn't clasp it and the whole thing starts falling and I catch it and it slides down to the end and the stone falls off and hits the cement and gets, you know, scratched or something. I would much rather have it catch, right? That's how I think. Anyway, there's that. And I definitely, that's, it, it, it says it's amethyst, but it's much more pink. So now that's not that's not the right kind of pink. Let's do these little cat's eye four millimeter. And let's do oh man, where are the rest of my uh amethyst? Ooh, wait, these are cute. Yeah. That's cute, right? Um something in the middle. That one's a little dark. That's better. Something in the middle of the beads attracts me like no other lover. Too different? Nah, I like it. Little blue shell in the middle. I'm liking it. It's all pastelly. Pastelly. Pastelly like Nelly. All right. Something in the middle of the beads. Should I do um the simple or the fancy? Let's we already did the um Simple, let's do a little fancier. We'll do the double strand. Uh, da, 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 da. So double strand, we need a little bit more. Take about nine inches. Da, 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 da. Wow, 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 wow. You're asking me where my love goes. Imagine if, um, who's the, who's the goat singer from the 80s? Um, not the Eagles, the, the band that was like the Eagles, but they were a little bit more um, edgy. Uh, Fleetwood Mac. Who's the singer Fleetwood Mac with the goat singing? You're asking me where my love goes. I don't know. I don't know. Come on, what's her name? What's that, what's that lady's name? Hey Eric, where are you? Where are you um, located that you're normally not awake at this time, or is it just a strange job you have? Stevie Nicks, yes. Stevie Nicks does the Beatles. Oh, that doesn't sound good. Um, Stevie Nicks covers the Beatles in a warm blanket so they can sleep. Um. I don't know, I don't know. Now you don't want to make these loops too small because you want to be able to do a cute little uh, scarfing on them. So that one was already kind of small. I might go back and roll it bigger. You can Look, you can roll it big, roll it small, you can play with it. It's fun, but lock it in and make that a little bigger, lock it in, roof. And we're coming up. I'm coming up, so you better get these beads all wrapped up. I'm coming up, coming. All right. And you stick around now, it may show. It's kind of like an owl. Ooh, ooh. I don't know why. It's like more owl than a uh, goat, right? No, no. Ooh. Wow, 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 wow,
Shall we do something fun? Shall we just stick to normal? Let's let's make them a little bit more spread out than normal, like this. So it's a little different, a little more interesting. You ever like memorize an entire guitar solo and then you're trying to hum it and you just you're like and you just sound like a dying fish to everybody else. Would a dying fish even make a sound? Like I don't know. If you know what I mean? Like if fish could make sounds, they came out of water and they're like wah 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 wah. Poppy, Karen is here. Beverly is here. Um, Eric is Belgium. Oh my gosh. I think you told me that before, Eric, and I forgot. What time is it in Belgium? And in Belgium, they speak French, right? Is that the main language? Or is it a few different languages? Two a.m. Beverly, you're in, in in Belgium too. Are you having a Belgian waffle? <laughs> no, they don't speak Danish, do they? Maybe they speak both. I think they speak French or Belgian. Maybe they speak Belgian. Maybe they speak waffle. Ooh, I don't even know if I took enough. I think I'm just just gonna make it. Me and my crazy just making it wired. And nope, that one's not gonna make it. Watch this. Da, da, nope, it's not gonna make it. Looks like we didn't make it. We've been traveling down the road. Flemish, huh? How about that? Why did I think they spoke French? Tell me a lot of them speak French or it's like parts of the country. I feel like I knew people from Belgium that spoke French or maybe I was, no, I think I was thinking of Switzerland. Swiss, the Swiss speak French? What was I thinking? Um, all right, so anyway, let's let's stop chattering and finish that one. Uh, where's the rest of our 22? Looks like we almost made it. And all we can say is, hey, looks like we made it. And that's way too much wire, but I didn't want to be stuck again with not enough. Looks like we made it. What are we at now? Uh, it's 7.30. we got to hurry up. Let's go fast. Let's get this done. All right. Hyperspeed, go. Looks like we made it. We've been traveling down the road. Da -da 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 -da. Ba -da -da. Ba -da, da 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 looks like we're gonna make it. Okay. That's there, that's cut, bam. That's in. And All right. Just like a paperback novel in a kind of book so still when it comes apart 
Now this, you want these to, oh look, I even made them go opposite without meaning to. I usually don't, I usually don't worry about it and these swirls end up going the same direction. But look at that. If you could read my mind well, y y although you wouldn't have to because I just basically tell you what's on my mind anyway. Because I don't have any filter. Whatever I think I say. When it comes to the part where you should hide your thoughts, I blurt them out anyway, and you'll never know what I'll say. And I don't think that matters much, but the people get touchy and say, you shouldn't say all those things. And I say, what do you mean? I don't know if that is wrong, but I sing the song cause I don't exactly care. I just like to wrestle a grizzly bear and he bit nibbles on my finger a little bit. It was like a little love nibble. He was like, oh, I know you're gonna beat me as I was shoving his head into the ground. He's like, I know I'm not gonna lose, but I gotta get a little nibble on your finger so I can brag to my friends that at least I got something. I was like, all right, Mr. Grizzly Bear, I'll let you have a little something. Um, this is number 22 and we got to go faster 22 look even the number 22 matches look at that who would have who, who thought of that it's like it's just like you'd think I planned it but no I don't plan anything I don't even plan where I'm going to sleep at night I just kind of point my vehicle in one in kind of the right direction and hope it ends up somewhere nearby yeah da 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 twenty-three. Let's do this pretty seashell. Oh so pretty. Twenty-two again, we're gonna use up all our twenty-two. Sorry, twenty-two. Take a lot this time, take a whole meter. A little more. A little more than a meter. A little more than three feet. Whoa, just knocked over something. Oh, well. all right, so this one has a hole right here. See that? Strange place for a hole, but anytime there's a hole anywhere, it makes it easier to anchor it. And so we bring it to the middle of the wire once again, in case you were in suspended belief, disbelief, wondering where it would be brought next. Um, come on, Zoom. There we go. And... Get this out of the way. So when you only have a whole top drill, this is what you do. You bring it to the middle of the wire, if you want to do it my way, and then crisscross, and then you twist. Now you can keep twisting if you want, and you know, or you can just bend it. I'm gonna keep twisting. Or you can just bend it at some point and make your swirl. Or you can keep twisting and have the twist go all the way around. It's totally up to you. Um, now you just play, make designs, and then come back up to the top and scarf it. That's it. That is it. You can play all day. Play the fun way. Play, play the exciting, beautiful, la 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 la. Sometimes it's fun to separate the strands and then put them back together. You don't know that the feeling's gone, but the feeling's here and now it's gone away. I don't know what to say. I found if I crisscross these in the back, it holds it tight enough that I don't need to, often don't need to add anything to anchor it later. Um, I don't know where you went wrong. Let's see, which, which strand is which? That is the inner strand. Sometimes they flip and they trick you and you gotta figure
figure out which is which before you proceed any further. It's over, always over bend it, and if you're going to bend it back to get a nice curve, and then just crisscross it here. Blah 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 blah. Blah 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 blah. Yeah da 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 da. And we'll come up like that. Give it a little bit of a more of a little extra bend there. And voila, scarfing time. Now, is this going to hold? Do we need to send a piece down there to grab it? Well, it'll hold, but to make it extra secure. Because it's always fun to know your piece is extra super secure. It makes you feel secure in case you're insecure. And look how easy that is. You just, just like, whoop. Slide it under there, and oh, there's a little indentation in the seashell. It's getting stuck on. Okay, and pull it through. Voila! Take your pliers and pull it tight. Press down so it doesn't move out of place. And see, I just slid that one out of place. And look what it does over here. Eh, messes up everything. See that? Messed up the whole loop. So now you got to put it back. You don't complain. You don't worry. See, it messed. It pulled that up too. Pulled them both out of place. So you don't complain, you don't cry, you just pull it back. You say, no, Mr. Wire, I decide where this stuff goes. Pull it back, and then you push, reposition it how you wanted it, not how it wanted to go. And pretty soon you're kind of back to sort of how you liked it. Okay, and now we continue back up here. And we continue to scarf it, bring it right where we left off. These two wires together, coming across and across and across and across. And finally, da -da -da, bam. Da -da -da. Boof. The camera's either too far away, or it's too close up, or it's not focused. At least you guys get to talk amongst yourselves. Oh, I should tell people how to get to the Etsy store. I'm so silly. That's the one thing I didn't do, was tell anybody. Like, haha, -ha, it's a big mystery. Okay, to get to the Etsy store for new people, it is... Etsy.com slash shop slash all one word, but I can't fit it. Matt Crazy Art Shop. You gotta write shop toys. It's not fair, but that's what it is. Type that in. Find Matt's Crazy Art Shop and then pick whatever number you want. Although I've only showed you number 21, 22, and almost 23. But pick which one, pay for it, and when I make the piece, it'll be yours. Or wait and see what it is, and if nobody bought it, then you can decide later on. Um, so, yeah. That is for you guys. No apostrophe, all one word. Got it? Okay. Ba da da. Between the lines, and know that I'm a ba da 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 da. Yeah, 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 yeah. Whew! Let's drink some water. Okay. Um, I think I'm out of chain. I'm gonna have to get some chain. I'll get some chain before I mail it off. Um, this definitely needs chain. I mean, this is a good one. Unless the person buying it who already paid for it is right here and they want this, this is only 16 inches. So you have to have either one it up high on your neck, which would look pretty, or have a skinny neck or both. Um, but I'm going to tell you that... Just adjusting that one little part right there. Um... If you want that chain, 
say so. If you need a regular size chain, 18 is more standard for people who might not have skinny necks or might want it longer. And it, I like to make them adjustable from like 18 to 22. So it fits most people. Um, if you want to wait, I'm going to buy more chain tomorrow and then I will be able to give you a more proper chain. However, if you are here present and you already paid for it and you want it in 16, I'll just pop this guy on. It's up to you. Anybody saying anything? I'm just reading your comments, sorry. It's, you're probably like, why did it pause all of a sudden? Half of Belgium is French, I knew it. All right, I think I read enough comments. Um, somebody bought 23. Well, whoever that is is not here. So we're just gonna say 23 is gonna get a chain tomorrow before we mail it. Or probably it'll probably go out on Monday. Um, okay, 23 is, no, 23 is not done. We gotta add earrings. Everything gets earrings today. Mm -hmm. um, that would be a cute little set by itself, but let's give it some pretty little earrings just these teeny tiny little blah da 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 blah da 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 I think these are shell too. They're four millimeter, but they're rondelles. Little baby rondelles. Help me, rondelle. Help me get the jewelry done. Ooh, shell with shell. Hell. Ooh, I almost said a bad word. Shell with shell. Heck, yell. Or something like that. Just threw the bead on the floor, too. Okay. Shall we proceed? Ah! Shall, shall we make the shells hold still? Look how cute that looks. Look at those, those and those. Now we gotta get a little teeny tiny itty bitty. I don't have any one smaller than that, but I think the cat's eye will go good again. Maybe, unless I can think of something else. Or should we do all blue? All blue? Mm -hmm. Yeah, let's do all blue so it's matching the seashell. Right? Yeah, that's pretty. I agree. Thanks for agreeing with me. Now we'll do the simplest of all, which is 20 gauge, just loop loop. No, no swirly anything. You don't even need that much. You need like barely two inches. You can read between the lines to know that I am trying to understand. Oh man, why did I say I was gonna do 10 of these? and do earring and necklace sets. I thought, originally I thought I was gonna do just crazy amoebas. Next week I'll probably do crazy amoebas, just knock them out fast. But I get, I start like overproducing and next thing I know it's like three hours go by. Um, so just simple, simple loop. Put that in, boom, press it tight. Come on, zoom, there we go, okay. So then bend it. Cut about a half inch, a little less maybe, depending on how tight you want your loop. Roll it, reposition, roll it. Make sure they're straight and even. A little bit, they're a little bit bent still. Try to be a stickler, get them nice and even. Okay, do the next one. I can read between the lines and know that I am trying to understand the feelings. What rhymes with understand? Nothing really rhymes with understand. I think this is the last time we're going to do 15. I think next week we might do 17 or 20. Um, 
because this is these pieces are too nice and they're taking too long but it was fun um, giving them away for half price I'm just not knocking them out as fast as I thought I would I'm like taking way too much time when I could be spending time just singing to you guys instead of playing around with these beads if you could read my mind, love, what a tale my thoughts would tell. Just like a paperback novel that you read in the prison cell. When the heartache comes from the barbecue that was cooked with too spicy a habanero. It's time to take care You can see between the lines and know that I'm trying to understand. Whoa. Okay. 23 is done. Um, again, 23 will have to get a chain later. But 23 looks pretty cute, I think. Pretty cute, do you think? I think. 23. Ta-ta. 24. Oh, well, I shouldn't have told them the Etsy. Guess what, everybody? This might not be the right Etsy, so if you already bought everything, maybe you should go back and cancel all your orders because it might be the wrong Etsy and somebody else is doing the same challenge and has the same numbers that look like mine and they copied me. So I'm just so maybe that'll slow it down. I think it'll slow it down. Or maybe it is the right Etsy. I'm not gonna tell you. Oh well, 24, let's go. 24, let's do the earrings first this time. Let's make some pretty. I like these little teeny itty bitty um, shell pieces. Can you see them? Look how cute they are. They're like six millimeter, but they're super flat. Oh, don't feel bad. Look, I love shell. Seashell is so pretty. Let's put all these little shell pieces together. Add more of these little rondelles. Help me, rondelle. Help, help. You can't see them. They're actually a little bit lime green. This camera isn't like showing you as clearly how lime green they are. Like mint green, rather, not lime. Mint, blue green. Mint is like a, a creamy whitish blue green, whereas lime is like more of a yellowy green. I think. I don't know. Um, That's cute. Now let's be a little weird and instead of using silver, Let's use, let's see, would they look good with antique copper? You can't see this antique copper. It looks like plain copper here, but it's actually very red. There you go, can you see it better? Mm -hmm. Okay, so you guys vote. Shall I switch it up and add the red into these pieces, which will make it funky? Or should I stick with the beautiful, dainty, whimsical princess colors and keep it silver? Definitely will look good with silver. It definitely will be okay with copper. You guys choose. You get to choose. Um, silver or copper. Silver or antique copper. You choose. I'm leaning towards silver, but gunmetal. I don't have gunmetal in 22 gauge, or I would totally do that. Uh, not at the moment. I think I only have it in. Oh, I have it in 20. We could do something with that. Silver, silver. Okay, silver wins. We'll do the one swirl. The other thing about doing the swirl instead of just making two loops when you actually spin it around is it strengthens the whole piece. So that's good, especially because 22 gauge is not the strongest. Um, okay. I'm going to stop talking and just hurry up and get this done. If I can find the hole. There it is. Okay. Da, 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 da. 
You might see between the lines and know that I am trying to understand. And if you want to make it stronger, the part that's on the bottom is where you want to put the loop. And then the other part is where you want to start all the wrapping. So here we only need half an inch like that. It's even too much. All right, we're going to go super fast now. It's turbo time. Got to get this done. If you hear any noise in the background, uh, my carpenter friend is building the wall. And not that wall. Don't don't get all like, ar don't argue with me. It's a wall separating my um, showroom from the rest of the place to make pieces and make videos. But it's a pretty fun wall. And I'm going to show you. I'm going to take a video of it later tonight. Hopefully. You can see this book of mine is la da da di 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 ya da 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 da. Those are pretty, right? Pretty. If you could read my mind, love, what a tale my thoughts would tell, just like a paperback novel, the kind of bookstores sell. Yeah, da 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 da, da 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 da, da 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 da, yeah da 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 da. Oh, did I already cut some yet? Already some? Yay! Nah, whatever. Da 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 da. As much as I am trying to understand, if you could read my mind, love. Do, 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 do. I don't like how that one is a little bit not drilled perfectly. I mean, you, it's it's fine if you see it from the, this side, but I think I'm going to switch it out for this one. That one is good on both sides. Kind of cool. It's pretty on that side. La 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 la. All right, let's go fast. Fast. It's time to move. If you could read my mouth, when it comes a time for the earring set, hey, hold still, you stop rolling. And you can see between the lines. Know that I'm trying to finish this piece. Ya da 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 da. And I will never cease until it's done. Okay. If you could read my mind, love, ya da 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 da, like paperback novels, la da 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 da. When it comes a time when the hero calls, you know they call um those Greek. Well, it's the Mediterraneans, all around the Mediterranean, all kinds of different countries all around the Mediterranean, probably 50 different countries make what they call in Greek, it's spelled G-Y-R-O here, but it's pronounced gyro, not, not gyro, unless you're uncultured. 
but so delicious, especially if you get it with the lamb meat Ugh. and the and the tzatziki cucumber yogurt sauce. Oh my goodness, right? But I like to say when I'm singing about a hero, I like to say it like I'm mispronouncing the food. When the gyro comes, the gyro will be me. La da 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 da. I am gonna have some fun with this. Let's make it all shell. Shall we make it all shell? I think we shall. <laughs> La da 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 da. Oh, look at that. I'm using this other piece. I already used one in the other one. I don't care. I'm doing it what I want. What is that? That's craziness. Let's not do that. That's too crazy. Too crazy. Let's not do it. Too late. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I'm coming up and I'm making a piece all of shell. I'm coming up with a shell. I'm coming up and I'm making this piece all of shell. I'm coming up with this shell. Uh, how much do I want? When it comes the time to make a piece of shell, we shall be carrying on with the shell. Let's let's get a shell that has a little more color to it. That one's just plain white. That's kind of uh, they're all kind of plain white. They're all kind of cream. Okay, never mind. That's about the best one there is. You can see between the lines and know that I am trying to understand feelings. That, ooh, look at that side. That side's cool, but it has like a black eye. Ooh. Okay, I'm coming to the middle. And bam. If you could read my mind, love. Yada, 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 yada. Just like a paperback novel. Yada, 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 yada. La da 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 da, la da 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 da. Bent in a three way twist. But ba da da, don't resist. Okay. And wrap. And we're wrapping it. We're wrapping it. We're wrapping. Wrap and roll. Now we're going to have fun here. Watch this. We're not just going to wrap it. With a normal diagonal, we're gonna be like wild child. Do some fun stuff. When the heartache comes, the hero will be you. Heroes do what they do. Oh yeah, baby. Oh yeah. Look at that. Oh yeah, that's fun, right? Having too much fun. Okay. These wires are grabbing each other. These wires always messing around with each other. It's a little inappropriate. And you wires tangling yourselves all up together like that. And you need a chaperone. Now watch this. This guy coming around and bam! I'm gonna do this fun pattern here all of a sudden. What, what is happening? This one should be worth, this is worth way more than 30. This one altogether should be like 30, 35, 50. But it is going for 15, if no one bought it yet. Know that I'm trying to understand. Da, 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 da. And you can see between the lines. And know that I am trying to understand. Ya da 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 da. Now it's fun, like that's fun, right? But I don't like that. I'm gonna pull it up like that. I just want to do it normal. I don't want that whole loop in there. Um. So we're gonna undo it even. Ha! Tricked ya. I'm just gonna make it simple like that. But. I'm gonna trick you again. I'm gonna come around and we're not gonna scarf it up at the top. Ha! Tricked you again. 
we're going to come back around here and fill in this part right there but we're going to separate them got to keep them separated okay and then we're going to bend it like that oh you didn't see that coming did you no you did not totally faked out everybody and because this is a little flimsy so i had to come back down and give it more strength and now we're going to come back here now you don't see this part from the front so it doesn't matter we're strengthening it now and we're going to give it a triple on the bottom part look at that triple strand hello look how fun that is whoa whoa and then we'll cut that now is this one even going to make it looks like he might not make it now nope, not going to make it so um what do we do with him you can't lose that triple strand that's just too pretty right can we get him up can can he, you think he can kind of make it up there let's see ah yeah yeah he can he can make it i think barely let's see If we can stretch him really tight, let's pull, pull really tight. And let's get these little teeny tiny round nose pliers to get you out of the way. And we'll hook him right into the loop. He's going in. Look at that. We're going to hook him all the way through and then close the loop on the other side. So he's going to be hooked in. Hooked in. He bought it hook, line, and sinker right in. I'm just manhandling him in. Look at that. It's like, there we go. Boom, locked in. Look at that, didn't lose the triple strand, not even a little bit. And now this one is gonna scarf and further lock in that little hook. It's like, really looks like we made it. Can we, go, can we go around that one more time? Oh my gosh, we're wrapping over this around like way too many times. I don't think we needed that around that. Yeah, let's go for it. Now that was a ridiculous tuck. Need a magnifying glass almost, but it's in and this guy is now very stable and strong and i'm loving this what do you guys think yeah yeah yes 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 i feel like a mermaid should wear it all right jump rings let's go still have three six millimeter left i don't even think we need three i think two two will do it because that's a tiny loop now three would kind of spread out and fan out that would be fun let's do it just for that mm. yeah see I'm under pressure to get these done faster. And am I making sloppier, ickier ones? I think I'm actually being forced to do things I normally wouldn't do every single day. So it's funny how pressure can force your creativity, whereas most people think creativity comes from relaxing and letting yourself breathe. But sometimes you need a little pressure. Sometimes you need a little bit Everybody needs a little pressure. People don't like pressure. 
but sometimes it's good for you and you can learn to like it. Uh, so, should this one get the 16 inch? The person who bought it, are they here? Do they want the 16 inch? It will look cute almost up as a choker, but I'm not gonna put that 16 inch unless they say so. Or shall I put a chain on this or do you think a cord, a black cord? I think a black cord might look good. Shall I get a chain tomorrow or a black cord? And if the person who's here bought it, they can decide. Otherwise, everyone vote. What are we gonna do? Okay, so Chris, here you go. Do you want to wait till I buy a chain tomorrow? Because I'm gonna get a bunch of chain and I'll make it I'll make it adjustable from 18 to 20. Or do you want this cord, which basically is already adjustable? I think I think this cord is about 18 to 20. It's either 18 to 20 or 20 to 22. I can check when I get a ruler. Um, but no, it's totally like whatever you prefer, Chris. This is kind of what the chain will look like, but I'll get a longer one. Whoops. So you get the idea. So chain or cord. Okay, Chris says chain. All right, 24. Looks like the paperback novel. The kind of bookstores sell. Oh, so pretty. This is like so, um, so uh, under the CE. Under the CE. Under the CE. Darling, it's better. Don't you forget her. Take it from me. Let's do number twelve. Uh, well, number twenty-five before we run out of time. La da 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 da. Let's do some sodalite. Let's do some wild crackle agate. Whoa. Whoa. Let's do some bigger sodalite. Let's do some. Amethyst because we can't put sodalite next to sodalite. That's boring. Let's do some cat's eye because the amethyst is too dark. I'm starting to like that. Shall we make that the official? Or we could take it this way. Well, now nah, I like the pink. I think, I'm, I think it's going to be a silver night. It might be all silver. Well, we're only halfway through. So, looks like we're halfway through. Ooh. Um, yep, I'm going to use up all the 22 gauge silver. That's okay. We've been traveling down the road, la 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 la, la 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 la, la 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 la, looks like we made it. Okay, bring them to the middle. We'll just bend and we'll do a bend and we'll do a loop and we'll lock it in. Another way to lock it in is simply just go bam like that. And we'll do a loop. See how far I can go without touching any pliers at all. Oh my gosh, he's wild. He's out of control. Somebody stop him. Stop him quickly, please. Oh mon dieu. All right. And we'll lock in this one. All right, both are locked in and ready to party. Okay. These are such pretty colors. Look at that crackle agate. Come on. Look at that. It's like exploring a foreign planet and like a fun planet. Imagine how exciting that planet is. How exciting. It's like ice capades all the time. This is like kind of like a, a cloudy moon. And this is like one of those gas giants, except it's small. 
because it's like it's like all like cloud like ethereal anyway all right let's do this so what are we doing first let's take this one and work our way up this time Okay, we're up here. I don't know, I don't think I wanna do anything wild. I think that stone is so pretty, I don't wanna cover it up. So we're just gonna do this. We'll just wrap it there. If I change my mind, I can still change. And we'll make this one come around the back side so it'll look pretty from both sides. That's something else you can say about jewelry, but not people. I mean, technically, if you're, if someone belongs to you, your significant other, you can, but you don't wanna go up to a stranger and, you know, stranger, you could say, oh, that's a pretty handbag you have, or I really like your necklace. You wouldn't say, excuse me, miss, you look wonderful from both sides. Oh my goodness. Um, let's see. You know what? We do have more wire to play with. We're not going to get too busy or crazy, but we're going to have a little more fun. Just a little bit, a little more fun. So there's just too much wire here not to have fun. So this is now going in the wrong direction. We could cross it and make an X, but I don't like making X's unless I want to do like a rodeo. It just X's to me look like, like cowboys. So, um... We're just going to, I see, I, I turned it, so now it's going the same direction as the others, and we're going to make it, we're going to go in between these and make extra, extra swirls. See that? See how clever? Now we'll lock that in there, and we'll probably have to do the same one with this one. Yep. It wants to cross, right? Oh, now we can cross, because now two crossing one doesn't look as weird. When you just have two crossing, you have an X, but when you have two going the same way and then one going, then it just looks like cool, right? See that? Now I can't decide, should I just go back? Nah, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna fold it again like that and I'm gonna go the same direction again because it's just fun. It's wild. Look, look at that. Look, at that. look it's wrong. It's wild and it's wrong and it's fun. Oh my goodness, the scandal. And, yep, yeah, we'll, we'll, um, wrap it in there. No, gotta go, gotta go around there one time and then we'll wrap it in there. And then we'll go around and wrap it. Ah, first time I'm picking up the pliers, I think. And then we'll wrap it right there, maybe. Yeah, pretty, right? That's some fun stuff going on. Okay, now we can scarf this little bottom loop. And scarf the top one. Okay. All right, now that looks very pretty. No matter which way it spins. Once again, to see if I can find a bunch of little six millimeter. I think I'm running out. Where's my silver wheel? One more section I can check. Nope. Nothing. Nada. There's one. I dropped it. There it is. 
Um, Matt takes the whole live show looking for six millimeter jump rings. There's another one. The scandal. The absolute scandal. He had us held hostage there on the camera. Couldn't leave. We were in wondering what was going to happen next, so we didn't want to leave. But he's just sitting there, just dang fooling around with them piles of jump rings. And I'm, that's, can you see? Look at look at these jump rings. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Stop! Whoa! Whoa! Okay. Um, I'm telling you, it was just, it was just horrible. He's so inconsiderate, and uh, I'm, I'm, I want my money back. I want, I want the piece still, but I want my money back. I paid for the show. And I don't care if it was free. I want something. You guys still here? Sometimes you wake up from a nap and you feel really good, but you got to do it just right. You can't nap too long and you can't nap too short. If you nap too short, you're like, oh, I could use more. But if you nap too long, you're like, oh, what day is it? What planet am I on? But if you nap just right, you're like, ah, I did it. Looks like I did it. Oof. Okay. All right, guys. Chain or cord? This time I don't care. You vote. Chain or cord? That's the chain. Again, I'm not going to use this chain. I'll use a bigger chain, but you can see how it looks. Chain or cord? Vote now. Thanks for hanging out, Eric. Dino has a whole big family and a whole full-time job. He's like very busy. He's a very busy werewolf. Cord it is. Froggy want a cord and he did ride a cord. Froggy want a cord and he did ride a cord. Froggy want a cord and he did ride. Okay, I need to get a different song in my head instead of freak, ridiculous Barry Manilow. So, somebody help me out. Uh, all right, we need to do earrings to go with this now. Get off, chain. Get off. Oh, the chain got locked in there. Um, okay. I'm thinking. I'm thinking. Every day I'm drinking. Just the right way I'm rolling. Thinking maybe those. Maybe. Shall we play with these guys again? Is that pretty? These little shell guys. Shall we put the cat's eye at the top? Is that pretty? Do we need more blue? Should we put the shell in there again? Is that too much? Ooh. Is that too long of an earring? Is there such a thing as too long of an earring? Yeah, yes, yes, no shell. Just, wait, no long shell or no flat shell? Yes to everything? Lori says yes to everything. Oh, yeah, thank you, Angela. I'm actually reading comments. I'm sorry, you guys. If you ask me anything, I've not been reading 90% of the comments. I've been hor horrible, as the French say, and the Belgians, half the Belgians. No flat shell, says Beverly. Oh, my goodness. 
Lori says, yes, 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 everything. Look at this. We're going to make it even worse. Teeny, teeny, tiny little cubes. Wow. Okay. We'll just be wild. We'll be wild, child. I hope that's okay with you, Beverly. Um, just use up all the 22 gauge silver. Little tiny swirls all over the world in my back door. What? Am I totally out of those? Okay. Well, here they go. If you read the part where the earrings come, la da 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 da, la da 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 da. I'm starting to second guess now. If I did only have like that, that would be pretty too. But let's see. One more vote. Shall we just do these three or shall we do all five? Now that you see how it looks. Where are your comments? Oh, somebody's saying no pink. Just these three. I don't want to do four. I'm weird like that. I like to do an odd number. All right, what are we voting? <laughs> Someone says the more wild, the better. Someone says fewer would be better. In right back to back. Someone says three, someone says five. Oh, Margers. It's the last time I ask you guys. I'm just going to go with it. I'm just kidding. I will always ask you guys if I can. All right. Three or five. Cast your votes now. Begin. Everyone who just voted, just vote one more time, just so we know. We'll start with Angela. Angela says five. Denise says three. Midday Moon Creation says three. Denise says three. Wait, Denise, you already said three. All right. Laurie says five. It's it's tied up. Karen says three. Did Karen vote? Oh, Karen, Karen didn't. All right, Karen voted earlier, but this is her official vote. Karen says three. M. Fitz happens. Did you vote yet? Okay, M. Fitz happens says three. All right, it's uh, three is winning. Turquoise on top, pink on the bottom. All right, this is going to be the top in case you're... I like to go big to small lately. That I used to like to go small to big. I don't know what's wrong with me. Um, Rainy, Rainy McAllister. All right. Um, or could we do it like this? How does that look? No, that's too small. Okay. Now remember, it has to match this. So, mm -hmm. yeah, I think threes are winning. I mean, I would, I'd be happy with the five. That would be fun. And I kind of miss the fact that it was going to be really wild. We'll go wild on the next one, but I think... I think the threes are really going to tie it together elegantly. Um, so threes it is. Okay. Do, do, do. You know what? I'm going to hold on to this pattern. I might do it next. I think I have enough. Yep. I have enough. I can do. I'm gonna do that pattern for the next one. It was just too cool of a pattern to to let go. All right. Um, so let's finish this one up. There we go. Now we're moving, we're setting up the next one before we even begin. Do 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 do.
All right. Yeah, that looks good, right? It looks good. Nice, nice match. To do next one all right what's people saying what song are we singing since you took your love away what, who sings that rainy how do I say your name Rani Rani sounds exotic. Is it rainy? Is it ra rani? Ronnie? How do you how do you spell it? Um. How do you spell it phonetically? Well, anyway, that was nice. That was very friendly. That was a nice thing you said. That was very kind. So let the rhythm. Boo -doo. Um. I don't want to pick on your favorite Shanae O'Connor. Shanae O'Connor has a beautiful voice. And what I, what I love that her voice best in is, I don't know. What does she actually sing that we, that became famous? No, oh, barely gonna make it. Okay.
Okay. Whew. What number is this? Is this 25? Are we only halfway done? This is scary. Very scary. Yep, that's 25. Air Mergers. Sing a Beatles song. When I find myself making jewelry too slowly, soon I look at the time and I speed it up, trying to make it faster. Yes, I do, 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 do. Yes, I do. Yeah, ah, oh, just knocked the box over. Ah. It was an empty box. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. All right, let's do these funkies. Funky, funky monkeys. Funky monkey. That chunky, funky monkey. That chunky monkey funky, where are my cat's eye? And the cat's eye in the cradle and the silver spoon. Ooh, I only have two cat's eye left. I think I have more, they rolled away. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. When I'm moving slowly, I move faster, yes I do. This is so inspiring. Um wow. Wow. Okay. Now fun. What was our pattern? Is like this, this, stop it. Here, oh, and we had a little blue one. A little blue one in there. Let's try, let's try an adventuring instead. That blue's a little harsh for all those pastel colors. Oh yeah, let's see. All right, 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 right. Okay. Okay. All right, what do you guys think? Hmm, I like the blue better. I thought I wanted the green. Yeah, let's just stick with the blue. You can always do green another time. Um, now, I don't even know if we have enough silver left. Yeah, we have just enough. Silver again. Oops. What, what's everybody saying? And the cat's eye in the cradle and the silver wire. Going so fast, we'll set the board on fire. Ha 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 When we will finish this live show, I don't know when. We'll turn the camera off then, yeah. You know, we'll turn the camera off then. My wire arrived just the other day. I ordered it online in the usual way. Couldn't see if there was time to pay, but it arrived while I was away, and then I opened up the package, and then I knew this wire was going to wrap in blue stone. The wire was going to wrap in blue. Bong, wang, wang, bong, wang, 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 bong, wang, 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 I told those beads stand, hold still for a while. 
They rolled away and they chuckled with a smile. I said, if you don't hold still, I'll beat you with a hammer. And then they said, fine. And they started to stammer. And as they got on the wire, I began to see the beads were looking free. Yeah, the beads were looking very free. Oh, okay. I think we're good. That's cool. That's funky. Ooh, these little teeny tiny ones—they don't even hold still when you make a. a uh, what's it called? When you make a when you make a kink or a, a, a whatever a bend. Uh. Okay. All right. Whoof. All right. I shouldn't be wrapping that until I finish making the loop up here. That's going in the opposite order. Okay, new song. What are we singing? The beads are looking back at me. Beverly, you're so PG-13. Barely. Nope, I already started wrapping that one the opposite of this one. Oh well, whatever. Let's just finish it. I'm a teenage boy at heart. Oh, you're just talking about yourself. I thought that was a song. It's like, that's a weird title for a song. All right, so we're going we're gonna to move this the opposite way and have it come around like this Whoop. okay twisty turny twisty turny Okay. Hmm. It's all kind of bent. It's all bent up. Let's make it straight. It's all twisted every which way. That's okay. You're beautiful just the way you are. All right. Ba da da da. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Need more wire. This is going to be the last of it. That's not even going to be enough. Oh, shoo. Oh, shoo. Oh, shoo. Is that going to be enough? Let me, let me calculate. Yeah, we'll give it a shot. If it's not enough, we'll just take it apart. Wasting yet more time. Little tiny swirls on the jewelry. Ooh, look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Um, yeah, of course this camera won't focus. Look at that yellow on that shell, how it goes with the rest of the colors. That's really cool. I like it. Ah! Little teeny tiny one ran away. I don't even know where it went. 
it escaped. <laughs> All right, let's make that loop before it escapes again. Oh my gosh, can you even loop right wire? What is happening here? There we go. All right, loop is made. Loop is locked in. All right, can we do this? Can we do it? Do you believe in wire? I can feel something inside me say, I'm really not sure it's long enough, oh. But that is a really pretty seashell in the middle there. Uh, yeah, we're gonna make it. That one's gonna make it, I don't know if that one is. We'll find out. Stay tuned on the next episode of Will This Wire Be Long Enough? Probably should have made, put it in the exact center and measured better because then I probably would have made it. But let's see. Ba -da -da -da. Da -da 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 -da. All right, here it goes. We're off to the races. Oh, oh we're just going to make it. Just made it. Look at that. Looks like we just made it. We are back to this song that I'm getting sick of singing. What a terrible thing. Okay. Ah, it's in. It's in, it's in. And these guys are all good. That's good. That's all good. Okay. Earrings are done. Now we get to find a pendant to go with it. And then we just have to do like four more. All right, let's go turbo speed. Black shirt, off black. Oh, who's to Beverly gave me an idea to everything turn, turn, turn. There is a season turn, turn, turn. and a time to every purpose under heaven, a time to be. An amethyst, a time to be Imperial Jasper. Definitely the Imperial Jasper is going with this. No, maybe not. Look at that amethyst. Wow. Oh, you can't see because it's like the, the, um, there you go. The glare was on it. Ooh, that's a tough one. Did anyone buy it? If anyone has number, what are we up to, 26? Yes? Yeah, number 26. If you have number 26, speak up. Um, okay. 26. I'm thinking the Amethyst. I mean, that's a cool match, but the Amethyst is more elegant, I feel like. Um, I mean, wait, let's take the glare off it again. There we go. Look at that. Unless number 26 is here and wants the Imperial Jasper instead, we're going to go with the Amethyst. I don't know. I kind of like that now. I'm just, I can't decide. We'll spend the whole live show deciding. All right, everybody vote. Amethyst or Imperial Jasper, which is it? 
Boo boo do. Boo do boo boo do boo. In the meantime, we're gonna use 20 gauge because we're out of the 22. Do 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 do. Do 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 do. Oh, well, that wasn't hard. All right, Eric is half and half, and everyone else says amethyst. Ba -ba -da -ba. It has a hole drilled in the side. So let the wonder. Mm -hmm. Okay. Bend it. Twist it. Keep it over the top. Turn it on a right angle. Put the strands together. Make a loop. Fold it across and start having fun playing. This is a super simple wrap. I took way too much wire. Simple but elegante. I mean, look how easy that is. I mean, honestly, I can't do more than that. If I do more than that, it's going to be too much. I'll just let the just let the amethyst be. Let it breathe. Right? So we just come up the back. Um And scarf. That's it. Good. Finally, we're moving faster. Let's get this over with. All right. So let that wonder. Boom. I don't like that. So I'm going to pull it back like that and crimp it. Oh. Now that's snaggable, that loop right there. You get that and see, see how it comes across? I could just grab it and pull it right up like that, and both of these would just come right up. I mean, it's probably safe. It's probably going to be fine. But you know how crazy I get with that. So where's our 26 gauge? What can we do here? How can we lock it in better? Oh, this 26 gauge got all tangled. I don't know how. It's on a spool. How does it tangle itself on a spool? It comes out at night. does its own thing. What shall we do? That has to be locked in like right there. So we'll come down to the base of it, put a wire through it. And figure out where to lock it. Um, there's really nowhere to lock it. The best we can do is lock it right here. That'll keep it from, yeah, that'll, that'll keep it from getting snagged enough. Okay, that's easy. Yeah, that's sliding under there so nicely, so easily. Sort of. It almost was.
There we go. Is that under? No, it's not under. Ugh. This is where I pause the camera in the videos. You don't see me I'm trying to get my get this a tight spot. There we go. It's in. It's in and we'll pull it. Voila. All right, that's tightened there. Um, it'd be good to tighten it. I'm, I'm gonna wrap it. Just wrap it through here, both of them. Just send them both through. Just come around a few times, just to kind of wrap it up diagonally. See how that's it's coming up? It's not the cleanest, but it'll do the job. And this is the back of the pendant, so no one will ever know, because the pendant will never spin around. It wouldn't it wouldn't betray us like that. Oh, look at that. I just kinked the wire like crazy. Look at that. That little loop, if I keep pulling it tight, it's gonna turn right into a kink. So we just, we just gotta just turn it around like that and be like, no wire. Behave. Go through there without kinking. There it goes. Popped out. Look at that, though. That's it's still you still want to smooth that out a little bit, and be careful because that could make a, a really weak spot and just break, just break on you. Okay, so I'm gonna anchor it right to that little part right there where we first started. Let's see if we can get in there. Yep, it's easy. I'm gonna do one at a time now. To be safer. Okay, we're good. Now we'll just wrap it into the scarf. The very thin wire just just blends right in. You don't even see it. And um, and then just come up here, cut it, bend it in towards the. I actually make two little hooks sometimes when it's like that, and I just shove it right into the little bowl of the scarf. Okay. This one's done. Blam, blam, and we're gonna use big jump rings because we can, and we're out of the little ones mostly. So these are eight millimeter. Quarter chain, I'm thinking chain. Quarter chain, uh, I'm not even gonna ask you guys, I'm gonna say chain, definitely. All right, what are we up to? What are people saying? Whose birthday is it? Oops, we got kicked off for a second there. The connection here isn't as strong as when I'm at home. All right, this is 26. Pretty, right? Those are some pretty colors. Hey, oh my gosh, look how pretty. Do 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 do. Ba da 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 da. Oh, we're not closing them up yet. Do do. Okay. Um. Uh oh, Lori. Lori and Beverly. Sounds like something nice happened. I missed it. Eric is still with us. Eric, you're so cool. Thanks for hanging out. Um, I think we're pretty much out of silver, so antique copper it is. Boo -doo -boo -doo. Boo -doo -boo. We have ant. We have um, imperial jasper. Boo -doo -boo -doo -boo -doo -boo -boo. Do 
Okay, um, I'm guessing this is going to Lori. This or whoever's is going to. If you're here, tell me which one you prefer of these three. Pick. We'll call them one, two, three. Okay, one, two, three. Ba -ba -da -ba -da. All right, somebody tell me one, two, or three, or um, whoever's actually getting it gets the, the, the real vote, unless they're not here. One, two, three. Sassy says two. Anybody else? Who's actually getting it? Is that person here? I know I missed something. Let's let's get a better look at them. There you go. Now you can see them without the glare. Maybe I should keep the camera like this, right? Get that glare off of there. All right, two it is. Oh, look at this one. This is a cool one. Check this out. It could go either way. I, uh, to me, this is this is the top. This is the bottom. It just is. There's more weight down here. Um, but they drill it straight. These funny Imperial Jaspers, they drill a hole straight across a different part, usually a thin part. But it's not across here. It's across here. The hole's down here. So this is an educational moment because we put it through the hole. And normally we would make the loop there, but this is the bottom. So what do we do? Well, first we cry because things are not working out the way we wanted and life isn't fair. And then we... Whoa. There we go. Then we come up to the top. Give it a couple twists. And boom, we're at the top. And then we make our loop. Ta-da! Oh no, it's just floating. That's okay. We'll take care of that because we know what we're doing. So we got our loop here. And then we come around and start making some patterns. I feel like let the stone talk to you, let the wire talk to you. I feel like this is coming right in that crag right there. But this one is coming across right there. There we go. Like that. Nice and tight. Okay. Now what? Ed and now let's figure out what comes next. Give it a twist and let's be wild and crazy. 
um, we'll separate them in the back here so that they come back on opposite sides. And because they're coming back on opposite sides, we can give them the fancy swirl where they cross arms and start doing the square dance. Around and around and around and around and around and around they go. Around and around and around and around and around and around they go. Around and around and around and around and around and around they go. All right. And now we're where to? Well, I don't want to cross across there. Sometimes I cross across, but this time I don't want to. So we'll just do a little a little curvy curve. And, and we'll disappear around the edge here. Boom, just like that. Let's see. It's like ocean waves. And now we'll come up here, cross it. Nah, no, nah, let's not cover that up. That looks pretty, right? Come across here and we'll scarf it, but we'll, um, we'll hold that. And uh, we should lock that in a little tighter. There we go. All right, so. Now that is scarfed and it's tight. It's moving a little bit still, not as bad as before. Because this is 22 gauge, we're gonna use it to secure itself because mm -hmm. we have a lot of wire left. So there's a lot of things, a little moving a little bit. They're pretty tight, but they could be tighter and they could be secured better. So first we'll um, find out that's loose and that's loose. So come through here, see what that does. Sometimes it's just experimenting. What's gonna happen? Whoa, okay, and that yanked that all the way out there. That's not what we wanted. That's not the kind of experimenting we want. Hello, put that back. Whew, do you even remember where that was? Oh my gosh, that was just rude, so rude. Sorry. All right. Get that back where you had it. Okay, that's better. Now, definitely need this to come across here because we need more strength coming in that direction. So can we put it like that? Yeah, that's cool. Like that, does that work? Or should we just leave it? No, I kind of like that. That's different, right? That's really different. Let's have that come across there. No, we're not gonna do that. Because that just makes a whole nother part that's really snaggable. And that's what we're trying to get away from. Okay. So. All right, this. Go under here again. This time we'll be a lot more careful not to pull it too tight. Okay, and we'll, from here we'll come under here. This time we also will not pull it too tight. under again. Looks like a kite in the back. All right, we're just going to end it. No scarf. Make this loop a little bit rounder. 
believe it or not, it's better to use your flat flat nose to make it rounder because it takes the sharp corners out by flattening them. If you use your round nose because they're not big enough to actually make get in the whole part and you start pinching them like that, it, you could actually make more corners. It's counterintuitive, but that's a lot of things in life go against what you would think would would be the obvious. Okay. Oceany. It's pretty strong. Let's um let's do some uh crimping. Get it stronger. Make sure when you're crimping, you're not pulling this stuff out of place again like I just almost did before. Okay, good. Good, 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 good. P pretty. Um, actually, I have big giant um, antique copper jump rings to go with this somewhere around here. Oh, there's some in here. Okay. Whoa, there's a crazy huge. They're too big. Way too big. I'm gonna have to get I'm gonna have to get better ones. Put that on my list. I need chain and jump rings. Oh, the really good anti-copper jump rings are only at Joanne Fabrics. I'm gonna have to go there. Alright. There's our pendant. Let's get some matching earrings. Finally, let's go with the green, right? And the blue. Oh yeah, that's looking good. That's a good match. Feeling it. So let that wonder you deep inside. Put the little rondelles in the middle. Oh yeah, look at how the rondelles match the light color. Oh, you can't even see what I'm doing. Whoops. Haha. <laughs> look at how those rondelles match the um light color there. And that matches the dark color and the green. Eh, there's a little bit of green in there somewhere. So cool. So let that wonder. Help me, Rondell, yeah. All right, we're just gonna do the simple single, single thread around the beads. Oof. Got a little too fast for my own good. I almost made that sharp end stick back out again. That was a microscopic cut. It was like half a millimeter. All right, one. I like walking in the rain and the snow and there's nowhere to go and feeling like a part of you and I and you're looking for the answer in her eyes. Says you want to bring up. It makes me hard to make up. Ooh, you make me love you. Ooh, you run away. 
Anti copper jump rings. What is this? 27? Three left. We can do this, guys. We can make it. Here I thought I might finish by nine. What was I thinking? Oh, this is so pretty with the anti copper and the and the aqua tones. Oh mind you. Here my gosh. Okay, um, I'm going to ask, no, I think I'm just going to do black cord, unless, unless uh, Laurie does not like black cord, I'm assuming this is going to Laurie at this point, I have black cord, or, oh no, wait, wait, okay, so there's black cord, I have, um, okay, okay, I have, okay, chain, kind of chunky, it's not as chunky as that huge spool I have. It's close, though. So kind of chunky chain. That's pretty, too. So I can go either way. Do I have enough of this chain? Um. Yeah, no. I could throw some jump rings on the end. Um, I have about 17 inches of this chain. Okay? So black cord or chain? I think chain, but... Laurie, how how uh, long do you need a chain? I also have a ton of this other chain, but it's so small. I feel like it's way too dainty for the for the piece. But it's up to you. Yeah, Lori. Lori will remember. Lori's messaged me before. Um, so Laurie, if you want the chunky chain, which is my favorite, it's going to be, um, it's only about 17 inches. I can try to find more chain somewhere. You know what? I can, I could put it, I, you know what? I can make as long as you want. If you want the chunky chain, I can add, this is extra chunky chain. I'll just add this on the back as like, as an extender. It looks like the same chain, but you can see it's like quite a bit bigger, but it would blend in if I put it on the back. Um, braid the black cord into the chain. Um, you can try that. Oh, wait, let me see. Actually put it through the links. That's different. What? So like, put the black cord. Let me take, take this, um, off for a second. This is different. All right. All right, so we're gonna just snake it in and out like like that. Does that work? Has anyone ever done this before? Um. Yeah, I I don't think it's no no. If you pull it tight, it's no. It's not really. It's not laying. No, it kind of it will if you pull it tight, it'll lay right. Do you want? Do you want that? Do you want me to snake it through like that? Like, let's see how that looks. That's that's definitely different. Does that make it look too thick? What do you think? Okay. Um. That's a different idea. I mean, you could just put them side by side. You could put them both. We could do that. Um, we could just, 
You can have it like this and like this. And then where the chain ends, I'll just try to connect it to the black cord because the black cord is longer. The black cord is like 20 to 22 inches, I think. That would be different. Or I could just do the chain and add the connector. All right, so just chain. Chain is good. I think it looks really pretty like that. See that? Okay, chain it is. That means we are going to add those giant jump rings because this is huge chain, and those jump rings are not going to look so terribly big once we... Nah, I might still add the smaller jump rings. Those are humongous jump rings. Oh, my gosh. I need the medium-sized jump rings that are just a little bit smaller. So I'll try to pick those up at Joanne. If I can't find them, I'll use this. All right, so that's that. This is number 27. We'll finish assembling it later. Where's that giant chunky chain? I'll add a little bit of that. Um, is that good if I get you to 22 inches, Laurie? Is that long enough? You want it longer? Um, throw in the... Oh, I love how those earrings match. It's awesome. Okay, 27, three more, 28. Okay. Oh, I'm getting hungry. I'm gonna go eat some food. I'll be back in an hour. Haha, <laughs> just kidding. Um, is that too fancy for a whole earring set? It might be. Let's do... Let's do this one. This is going to be pretty too. It's another Imperial Jasper. It's just dyed more of, more of a um, midnight blue instead of a instead of a blue green teal aqua. Uh, where are my cutters? There they are. Okay. Too many. Ba -ba 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 too many. Da -da 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 and this one is here at the top. That's fine. Um, all right, this one's going to be very similar to the amethyst. So sorry, guys, if it's if you're seeing the same thing over again. But we got to get moving with this. I'm just wrapping around and around and around. Ugh. Who loves, um, what's it called? Who loves, uh, I want to say Tom Petty. It's not Tom Petty. It's, um, well, I'll just sing the song. You tell me who it is. It's late in the evening. She's wondering what clothes to wear. She puts on her makeup and brushes her long blonde hair. And then, then she asks me, do I look all right? And I say yes. You look wonderful tonight. Yup, that's Eric. Who likes Eric? I'm so tired of picking on people and making your hearts break. So this one I'm coming down on a diagonal. 
diagonal, diagonal, diagonal. Then we're coming back up this way, which locks it in so we don't need to do any further um, securing later. So we come across and we come across, we're only going to come across on the upswing twice because we don't, again, we don't want to make it look too much like X's, but that's it. And we're done. Now that loop is not totally round, so we'll mess with it, mess with it a little bit, get a little rounder. There we go, that's better. Just a tiny bit of adjusting. <laughs> Beverly likes all the wrong ones. Time to go home now. I've got an aching head. I drank too much vodka. Didn't live healthy instead. And then she asked me, Do you feel all right? And I say, No, I'm gonna vomit all over you tonight. I'm going to vomit all over the carpet and the floor right in our room. And the wonder of it all is that you just don't realize how much we need a better cleaning lady. <laughs> Uh oh, is Beverly getting violent? What was she talking about? Okay, that's nice, but let's make some really pretty earrings to go with it. Um, I'm feeling these. Lapis, these are not lapis lazuli. That's lapis lazuli. That's not, that's sodalite. Um, what do we have in here? That's sodalite. This is, oh, get out. Bigger sodalite. Stop it. Here's some kind of jasper. Kind of break it up a little. Stop rolling away. Nah, it's too much. We'll stick with the blue. Um, we do cat's eye again. How do I? I have one amethyst in here. It's ridiculous. Amethyst would work. I'm just getting so bored with amethyst. I just do so much of it. I mean, it's a really pretty stone, but look at this. It's like a cherry red. It's kind of cool, right? Let's do it. Let's do that. I like that. Do that with the sodalite. We don't need these smaller sodalite. Um, and then shall we keep the cat's eye? Let's see. Hold still, you weirdos. I, if you do that again, nope, too, too light. Maybe now we can add the amethyst. Aha. Uh -huh. uh, no, get back here. Oh. Oh, yeah. Yep, they, you have to discipline your beads or they just walk all over you or roll all over your table, which is the equivalent of walking all over you because that's all they can do is roll. Yep, I'm feeling it. Stop me if anyone objects. They look like little berry clusters, like, um, I don't know. Just 
different. Remember that commercial for Nuprin? Nuprin, little, yellow, different. What a, what a weird commercial for a painkiller. Like, honey, oh, my head hurts so much. Would you like Advil? No, I want to try something different this time. Tylenol? No, no, honey, I want to try something that's like a really different color. A different color for your headache. Yeah, yeah, honey, come on, work with me here. I want I want something with a different name that's untrusted, un, un, you know, nobody really knows how good it is, but it's like, like a neon color for your headache. Yeah, come on, see what you... Just in time, Nuprin, little, yellow, different. Well, guess what? Product I haven't seen in like 20 years. And in the commercial, the whole commercial would be black and white, except for the Nuprin. Nuprin would be like neon yellow. Like I was a kid and I was like, that's dumb marketing. Like what? I was like, huh? Nuprin, little, yellow, different. What other what other bad commercials went the way of the dinosaur? What are some good ones? It's easier to remember the good ones. Remember the Energizer Bunny? Still going. Remember when the Energizer Bunny would make fake commercials and you thought you're watching a commercial for something else? Is your long distance carrier not giving you the 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 prices you want? And then all of a sudden the Energizer Bunny would come into the commercial and like knock over the telephone still going. That was, that was a great commercial. Everybody loved that commercial. I, I don't know. I loved it. I was a little child and I was like, loved it. And if we're going to thread back up here, we've got to do a double here. Look at that. Got to do it. Got to do it. Oh yeah. Yeah, the other funny thing was, uh, was it 15 years ago? I, I know, I even knew, like as a teenager, I knew somebody won a lawsuit somewhere. Um, and because somebody won some law, not, maybe not a lawsuit, but the law changed and the law said, um, uh, what's it called? Medication had to announce all the side effects in the commercial. And I like, even as a kid, I knew... Oh, I was kind of a teenager, but like uh, medicine not only had to announce all the side effects in the commercial, they had to be at the same volume as the rest of the commercial, the speaker, and they had to be spoken clearly and slowly. Like you couldn't rush through them. Like, you know, you know, the, the legal speak at the end of a lot of commercials, products may vary. Um, you know, it goes with blah, 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 blah. Product is not authorized in the state of California, blah, 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 like all that stuff. Well, no, they couldn't rush the side effects. They had to state them clearly and at the same volume as the rest of the commercial and and at the same speed. I could tell all of that once these commercials started coming out. So what did they do? They're like they're like crap. Nobody's going to buy our, our our product when we have to state all these stupid things may cause hearing loss, inability to smell lemon and death. Projectile vomiting may occur. In some patients, loss of the left arm was found common. It, nobody's going to buy our products if we have to say all this stuff. So they thought, we'll just do the best we can. We'll, um, we'll put really pretty music. We'll state all the beautiful things about how the product will make your life better. We'll show happy people swinging on swings and riding horses and be beautiful sunsets and like people laughing. And then when we get to the side effects part we'll just plow through it and we'll keep showing beautiful imagery and hope that most people will just focus on what they really want in life and not the side effects 
and I'm sure it works for some people who are really desperate for, you know, whatever, or, you know, maybe it doesn't work at all. And people just take whatever medicine their doctor prescribes because their doctor, I'm sure, does not have to tell them all the side effects that way. But, so, you know, so whatever, but, and that's why it always says, like, talk to your doctor about, but they said they did the best they could do. They they listed all the horrible things while playing the pretty music with the pretty sunsets and the people laughing and playing. And then at the end of that, they went right back into the happy mode. Um, to talk to your doctor if, if uh, kill, kill it all, new medicine that kills everything about your li everything in your life, but also takes away one of the illnesses that you have. Um, see, see if kill it all is right for you. Get back into life with kill it all. Side effects include may become suddenly attractive to st st stray dogs. May develop an allergy to mushrooms. In 1% of patients who tried kill it all, their toes turned black and rolled away. Get back into life with kill it all. Ah, where's the beef? That was, yeah, that was, that one went a really long time. I was like a baby. I just, I, that one scared me. I think, I think that woman scared me because I was so little. Grey Poupon, yeah, that was a good one. That was weird. I didn't, I didn't even taste that until years later and I was like, oh. Imagine someone, I would really, nowadays, I would really take a bottle of mustard and just stop people at red lights and ask them if they would like some. Oh, no. All right, we have two more after this. Can we make it? Can we do it? It's up to you guys. I'm, I'm. I'm not sure I can make it, but I'm, I, I believe you guys will pull us through. How did I do that one? Ha! These are reversed. One I wrapped at the bottom and one I wrapped at the top. Uh, one I scarfed up here and this one I'm going to scarf down here, but they both ended up with the same type of wrap. That's weird. That's what I get for talking about funny commercials while I'm trying to do this. Um... Godzilla versus Lipitor. <laughs> Etsy name. Hi, Crystal. Here you go. Etsy for you. Etsy for me. Etsy for all of us. It's free. Um, I don't know if, if, you, if the comments are in the way, if you can see that. Um, it's all one word. Etsy.com slash shop slash mats. No apostrophe. TTS crazy art shop you have to put shop in there again okay and see if there's any left i th i bet they're all sold by now but you never know maybe i announced this kind of late this this live show and, and you know maybe maybe there's still some left and if not i have a lot of other pieces on etsy you can check i i lowered the prices on a bunch of them for this reason um <clears throat> Oh my goodness, Monique, I don't think I ever saw that. Or if I saw it, I was too young to know what was happening. Um. Hmm. Okay, don't, nobody tell me, don't tell me which one you bought until after it's finished. If it's finished and you're watching it, I'll ask your opinion and you then you can say, I'm the one who bought it and I would like a black cord instead of a chain or whatever. But um, don't tell me beforehand, because otherwise I'm going to get, I'm going to be thinking too much. Ooh, this person who bought it is watching right now, and I hope they would like it. And I, I just, I don't want to think about that. I want to just pretend it's all random. But, um, uh, 
Uh, thank you, Crystal. Um, but that's okay, Carol. That, I'm just saying for the future. Uh, oh, yeah, I like I like how this came out. Okay. Um, I'm saying Black Chord. I'm just going to go with it. Black Chord should be the name of the band, right? Black Chord, got to get the jump rings. Here you go, guys. There is number 28. Why do birds suddenly appear every time you are near, just like me, they long to be close to you. Imagine if you knew someone and you were dating and every single time you uh, went for a walk with him, like little birds started flying around and landing on their shoulders and stuff. You'd be like, part of you would be like, this is so magical, even the animals love him. And then another part of you would be like, I'm really creeped out and I don't know what kind of weird cologne he put on or if he knows something about bird pheromones, but that's creepy and <laughs> yeah, carpenter. Well, there's a carpenter. He's in the next room. If I left the door open, it would be really loud. Um, On the day that you were born, the angels got together and decided to create a dream come true. So there's a starry spark of stardust in your hair. Man and in your eyes blue. Uh, ha, ha. All right, I want to find my square wire. Where is my square wire? In da, 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 they come to be close to you, you, you do. That's where it's where Aaron Neville comes in to hum. I can't find the square wire. This is bothering me. Okay. Um. Oh. All right, this is different. Let's do this one. I would use silver normally, but I don't know. Do you think do you think that'll work? Antique copper? Yeah? What do you guys think? I'm out of silver. Um... I have my square silver. I wanted my square anti-copper. I can't find it. Uh, I could also do... Um, what could I do? On the day that you were born, the angels got together, decided to create a dream come true. I feel like that's too much. Too much for 15, even, you know, even half price. Um, let me see.
Oh, regular silver. Can this take regular silver? No, it's not going to go through there. Hmm. <laughs> that is such a pretty stone. Look at that. What? It's dyed. The blue is added, but that pattern is all natural. I, I just don't, I think this, I think the copper is wrong. I think it needs silver. What do you think? Copper is fine. Copper will be great. Copper will work together. All right. Now I can't decide what I want to do. Um, let's do... Ooh, now we're getting choices here. All right, I'm going to totally surprise you guys. I'm going to do this one. We'll do this one of these in next. This is number 29. On the day that you were born, Sit down again. That loop is too big. I don't like it. What can I do? I can roll this part lower. Can I? No, it's locked in. All right, let's try that again. Take two. So with very little time left, I'm attempting a very difficult rap because I can't make up my mind about any of the other stuff, such as life. On the day that you were born, the angels got together and decided uh, to create a dream come true. I'm so spoiled with square wire, round wire is like really irritating me because it's not, 
it's not behaving as nicely as the square wire. It still looks pretty though. I need to get some 20 gauge antique copper square wire. I think that would be awesome. Okay. On the day that you were born, the angels got together and decided to create a dream come. Oh, no. Do I not have... No, I'm going to have to use 22. Oh, 22 is actually what I wanted to use. Okay, I'm fine. All right. Um, doo -doo 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 -doo. Ooh, this is actually holding really tight for a minute. It's going to slip out any second, but at this second, it's actually, it's holding really tight. Voila. Let's try it that way. Oh yeah. Now I like it. it fit better that way. That's the way it was made. Okay. Noise. All right. There is our 22 antique copper. We just have it here. We're just using it. Where'd it go? I need to hire an assistant to just hand me things I can't find. So if anybody wants to be a, an assistant, I need like seven more assistants. Here we are. On the day that you were born, the angels got together. Da -da 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 -da. Whoa, I forgot it wasn't in there all the way. It just popped right out. Okay, all right, let's leave the stone out for a minute. Oh yeah. Let's try something different. This should be a video. We should do this in a video if this works. Let's, it's kind of like a, the one I just did. You're gonna see the similarities if you saw the video, but I'm gonna try something totally different too. Oh, this is gonna be fun. Mm. Just getting it through there is a little tricky. Okay, I'm gonna go through twice, and okay. Oh uh, yeah, this is gonna be fun. Hmm. When the wire's in the air and it doesn't have a stone to press against, it like it doesn't make curves as smooth. Look at those curves; they're kind of lumpy. You can you can sometimes make curves smoother, believe it or not, by smushing the lumps out. All right, now I'm gonna have to separate these. I'm gonna do this separate. Oof. Can I get it through there without messing up the curve? Yeah, we'll just make the curve part of it, right? Kind of, sort of. There we go, that wasn't too bad. How about this one? That one's going to have to go right through there. Oh no, oh, Trisha's here. Trisha, you, if you're gonna come here, you gotta tell, warn me first. You can't just pop in, because you know you know how things go. Actually, I have no idea who Trisha is. Do I know you, Trisha? I probably know. I forget everybody's names. I'll be chatting people up, chatting them up, chatting them up, and then the next week I'll be like, "Are you new?" It's terrible. It's absolutely terrible. Okay, let's pop it in and see what happens. Watch this. This is fun. So we have this pattern, right? 
Okay. This is a, this is like a modification of a one I did the other day. It was just yesterday, wasn't it? But let's pop it in. Ugh, it's tight. It doesn't want to go in. Come on. Make me believe I was believing in you. Possibility of stone. Okay. Smush it down on the table. There we go. Get in there. Papa says get in bed. It's time for bed. We're going to smush you with the... Oh, we got one side. Oh, that was too much. Okay. All right, I think we got to leave the stone on here when we do this. This is not coming out the way I planned. Experimental. All right, we're going to have to come around the back and anchor this guy better before we do anything else. All right, I'm going to finish this next time. No, 29 is going to have to be something different. Hold on one second. I got to check the carpenter. Don't go anywhere. Stay here. Okay, I'm back. Sorry, guys. Carpenter has to go, so I got to wrap this up. Um, so I'm just going to, I'm going to do these two. Uh, now I got to save that for silver. I'm going to do this one. Let's see what we can do. Let's do something different with the. Um, antique copper. Yep, to wrap it up. That's exactly right. I mean, I always planned these to be fast. I never planned to try to do an experimental piece in the middle of it. But I just got so caught up and excited. And I was like, I'm going to do it. And I got a little carried away. I really like this antique copper on the seashell. I would have never done it. If I had silver, silver would have been. But sometimes lack forces you to be, to discover new worlds. How about that for a plaque to put on the wall? Trying to be really daring. Can I make this? Can I make these strands come all the way around like that? Is that too wild? Yeah, that's 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 just gonna make a giant snaggable thing. Me and my snaggable worries. This one is just gonna get all the corners.
All right, now it's too busy. Um, let's make it less busy. Just go right here. Got a little too busy. I'm trying to make it less busy now by trying to combine some of the strands and move some of the others around a little bit. So it fills up the space, but it doesn't over. All right, I think that's a good balance. Um, obviously, we're going to do these. And should we do all of the seashells again, like craziness? I don't know, we'll figure it out. Or should we just do this? All right, real quick guys, simple, these, or just these with a pretty pattern, like a really pretty swirl, or everything all together. I feel like they look kind of like lollipops, like that top, they're a little top heavy. You know what'll make them better? It's gonna take longer, but let's do it. Let's just knock it out. We'll, we'll do a little bit of all of it. Let's see how fast we can do this. Ready? On your mark, get set, go. I don't even think that's enough wire. Might be. This is called speed earrings. The fastest earrings in the West. Poor Carpenter is going to be sitting here waiting for a long time. That's okay. He's getting a free ride home. Like, he would have had to take all kinds of public transportation at a, late at night otherwise, which is not enjoyable. Oof. There it is, there's one. It's gonna be wild. Well, they say good things come to those who rush. And we're gonna do it. Making those loops too extra big tonight. All 
Oh, shoot. I forgot to leave the loop at the bottom to connect them. Arrgh. Killing me. Everything else was so fast. That's what happens when you go too fast. I mean, technically, I could squeeze that little thing into a loop, but that's a little bit... That's too crazy. Here, we'll try this again. Loop at the top, loop at the bottom. Okay, now... Oh my goodness. So like, look how fast I can do it, guys. That's amazing. Just forgot one little tiny key component. All right. Okay. All right, there's technically that's one and we'll leave that for another time.
And just like the beads, these are four millimeter jump rings. I use four, six, and eight the most. Ugh. This is going to get the thin chain, unless you think it should get a black cord. Here's the thin chain. Here's the black cord. What do you guys think? Vote now. Chain it is. Good job, guys. I'm just going to guesstimate that that's about 18 inches because this stuff is all tangled up. Mm. Yeah, that's about 18. A little broken piece of chain won't come out. There it goes. Ugh. These jump rings are so. Ugh, I don't like that. Let me get the larger ones. Where are they? There they are. These are like extra, literally made of steel or something. Get off cotton. Nah, that's way too much chain. I cut way more than, I think that's like 21 inches. Yeah, it won't go in. All right, I'm gonna play with this chain later. I gotta take the guy home. Um, where'd the cotton go? Boom, boom. 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 Twenty nine. Thirty. What do we do? Thirty. Let's see if I have any other stones over here.
All right, there's these wild, I got the same seashell I just did, but these are dyed like wild, like almost iridescent. Yeah, not almost, like really iridescent rainbow E. So I think I'm gonna do one of these for the last one. Yeah, let's do that. It's purple, purple's cool, but anti-copper is like, it looks almost too close to purple. Yeah, this is gonna be fun. Let's do this. And then you guys are going to have to help me pick some beads for the earring parts. I definitely think already I'm going to do the, um, I think I'm going to do these. And I think I'm going to do these. And I think, what else, what else, what else? What about these? Whoa, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, 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 right. Haha, <laughs> let's begin. And that's the time. Feel like making love to you. Ooh, did I give myself enough? Well, we'll find out. I feel like making dreams come true. Ooh, ba da 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 da, ba da 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 da. Ooh, this is gonna be fun. I've never played with one of these. It looks like a, it looks like like a, a another planet with unicorns and and space age elfin fairy creatures and look at that. Come on, how pretty is that? Mm -hmm. That's the time. I feel like making love. I can't wait till this hoarse voice goes away. To you. Oh, oh this is going to be fun. Okay, check this out. Like, that's it. That's it. That's all we do. That's it. It's over. Now watch this. Come up here. Give these a couple twists. It's a good thing I didn't take too much wire. I mean, it's a good thing I didn't try to do a more ambitious wrap with so little wire. But... Look at that. This is like the fastest set I've done all night and Oh my gosh, you guys, I've had so much fun with you. This has been so much fun. I'm going to grab another one of those red ones because this one has like a little flat side to it, like a chunk got taken out.
Oof. Again, this, this wire wants to go, it wants to make X's, so we're gonna bend it the other way like that, make it change directions so it's flowing with the first wire. Yeah, I can't believe Eric is still with us. Eric, I hope you I hope you have the day off or I hope you have been sleeping a lot, taking naps. Eric like comments on so many videos. So awesome. Um really good comments too. So let that wonder you deep inside take you under na 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 I'm, I'm going to say cord, but again, we could do this chain. One last vote, guys. Cord or chain. Cord or chain. I'm, I mean, come on. That, that cord just pops. But I'll still let you guys vote because I'm okay if with the chain, too. Hi, Willow. Um, you guys have a wonderful night. I'm going to wrap this up in about three minutes. As soon as we finish this, this is number 30. These look so royal, like, like Egyptian royalty or like Indian or something. I don't know. Some from some, some far East royal something i think i love the antique copper on these colors it's like oosh. and this is just magical this is like from another planet like what is that 
what is that? I mean, I'm so happy even the camera's picking up the colors the right way. Number 30. Um, did you say cord? Did anybody say cord? Happy birthday, everyone. Or happy birthday, whoever's birthday it is. All right, somebody said cord. Good. Cord it is. So let that wonder take you deep inside and pull you under. Mm -hmm. Get in there, cord. Stop playing. This cord tries to fight you. Oh, yeah. That's the season. I got to take pictures of these. Last time I just mailed them out without taking pictures. What was I thinking? What was I thinking? So many pretty things. Um, I shouldn't compliment myself. It's not me, guys. It's just the stones. Somebody else mines them and polishes them and lapidar la la lapidaries them and all that junk. I just I just put a little metal on it. And, you know, just, it's all It's all beautiful people doing beautiful things. Number 30. Okay. Um, you guys have a great night. Usually I do a review and show you them all, but I got to get this carpenter guy home. Um, you have a ooh, wonderful night. You guys are amazing. You're so much fun. So much fun. All of you are so much fun. You're so amazing. Um, thank you, Eric. Thank you, Lori, Allison, Carol, Barefoot Hippies, Willow, Lori again, Beverly, Karen Branch. Willow again. <laughs> I'm just going through the comments. Trisha, Peaches, everyone else who I didn't mention. Have a great night. Have a wonderful night. I'll show you a sneak peek of the wall that was put up. And probably the carpenter is shy, but who knows. So, oh, let me turn the light off. So here's the front. Here's the gate that would be open. Here's the front. I don't know if you can hear, they're playing Dancing Queen. Um, here's the wall. Here is the door, the window. That's gonna be the countertop to take sales. And this door, behind this door, is lots of tools. And this will be, this whole room is gonna be for making more jewelry and stuff and Here's the back side of the wall. The back side is just gonna have tools up against it. So it's just plywood and it's gonna have tables and stuff. And um, here's, that's it. Have a great night, guys. Take care. You guys are the best. Bye, good night.